Hey guys, welcome back. Um, okay, let's uh, go find some stuff. Do I have space in my inventory? I do. Oh, yeah. I did actually just reorganize my inventory, so I don't know why I really had to look for that. But um, which is why there's that <laughs> that reed on the ground over there. But uh, okay, I don't know where to go from here. Um, so we're just gonna run this way. And hope we hit something good. Because if we don't, then <laughs> I guess I'm just going to have to start wandering on my own. Um, theoretically, I'm at the point where I don't really have to worry about dying, even if I'm wandering around at night, which I probably wouldn't do anyway. Um, because I've got full diamond armor and... Um, is it worth it to kill these guys? I mean, they might drop stuff, but... I don't know. Get out of my way. Um... But yeah, I don't I don't know where anything else is. Like, I don't know how many more biomes there can be in this stupid place. But, uh... Oh, right. That's what I was talking about. <laughs> um... I... What is happening here? Jeez. That sounded like a skeleton. I think I heard a skeleton somewhere, but... Um... I'm going to restock on some wool supplies. We'll just pretend like... I have three white wool. <laughs> because that's, you know, how many white wool I have. Um... Because I want to make a bed, should I need one. Because, obviously, you don't really want to end up, um... wandering around at night with no bed and stuff like that, because that'd just be bad. <clears throat> okay. Looks like we found some planes now. Um, these are probably the same planes that we were originally in. Oh, let's just die. Okay. Um, or that we started out in, I would guess. I'd, I'd imagine we've made a full loop around the island um, at this point, because you know, it's been quite a while. Um, I was trying to follow the water before, so, theoretically, you know, we'd be at the other side now. But, okay, why do they sometimes die? Does the damage, like, of even just a normal sword vary now? Because it didn't used to. So, I really don't know. These guys should give us plenty of food. Um, like, I know that sharpness and stuff varies the damage and like smite and things like that and the enchantments but I I wasn't so sure about the actual um, the actual weapons themselves sorry I just got a little confused I think I know where we are too um do -do 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 -do. I really wonder where the Victory Monument is. I mean, is it just, like, sitting out here in the middle of the plains? Because that's, like, where I would expect it to be. Um. Uh, yep. Yeah, there's... There's... Oh, that's that boat, actually. That's not our boat. That's a boat. Um. Which means we went around that way and then came back in. So we might actually just want to go back out to the other side and then continue around. I don't really know where we are in comparison to the spawn, because <laughs> um, we went pretty far from it, and I'd never really looked at the compasses or anything to see where it is. Like, I didn't realize, um, I did watch the first episode of uh, Paws and Paws and Vintage Beef's Lethemir playthrough. Um, but then I realized that they were going a different direction for me. I mean, they, they are on a different variation of the map, so it's not all the same, but as far as I can tell, the dungeons and stuff are all the same. It's just the the spawners that aren't, um, and, like, the chests and stuff. So that would mean that, um, you know, where the spawners are would still be the same. So I, I, it would be giving something away by watching more. Um, 
they I did see them find a cave that I didn't see originally at the spawn. I didn't I don't remember what was in it. But um or even if they went in it actually I don't think they, I don't think they did. But um nope, come here. Okay, I'm gonna have to make a chest now and man I need some more wood. I mean not a chest, a workbench. That's not what I wanted. Okay, what did I pick up on- oh, it was all that meat, right. Okay, just put the bed down. There we go. Alright. Uh, let's see. I came from... Excuse me. Just getting something to drink. Real quick. Man, it's dark in here. Okay. I want that. Let's see, what did I throw down? You know... Maybe I don't really need this. I still don't have that book. <laughs> um, I don't really need that. And so I'll take that instead. Eh, no. Yeah, there we go. Um, did I see reeds around here somewhere? I thought I did. But I could be wrong. Uh, you know what? Let's make a furnace real quick and cook up this food. That should be enough to cook all of that. Uh, are there any more cows around? Oh, there's one. Let's go get that guy. Oh, right, you don't need... You don't need leather for books. Come on, Ryan. You can remember this. Um, I forget that every time. So that makes things easier. Still can't grab that, though. Um... Yeah, we can put these in here. Let's see. Put that back down there. Let's go get some wood. I don't, I don't have any wood. So that would be something useful to have. I also don't have an axe. So, ow! Oh, jeez, okay. <laughs> that scare anybody else? Because it sure scared me. Jeez. I don't even have any arrows. I have too much stuff. I need to get rid of this big chunk of wool. And I'll have so much more space in my inventory. Like, it's literally taking up half of my inventory right now. And that's ridiculous. Um, right, what was I doing? I was getting... Was getting... wood. Yeah, yeah, that's hilarious. Um... Let's turn this into torches, and no. Get out of there! This is making me angry. Um, I don't really know why I did that. I don't really know why I have this cobblestone. Oh, I guess I need it to make furnaces. But, you know what? I, I can just get more cobblestone wherever. Um. <clears throat> Alright, let's go get that wood now. Now that we have an axe, <clears throat> which I could have made out of iron, I just for some reason didn't choose to. What, is my inventory full again? Oh, son of... Give me that wood. I don't care about the, the meat anymore. Although I will in a second. Yeah, whatever. <clears throat> but yeah, um... So, eventually, I want to find my way... That was weird, my mouse just went weird. Um, my mouse was unresponsive for a second there. Uh... Eventually, I want to go back to the spawn to check out that that cave that um, Beef and Paws found. Because I know there was coal in it, but that was just, like, right at the entrance. So I don't know what else would be in it. Um, might as well take that one piece of, one piece of wood. And I'm just going to um, cut this until it's done. So you'll see me in just a second. Alrighty, so, we've got 49 beef, cooked beef thingies, uh, it's a nice square number, um, so let's move on and try to find what may or may not be at the edge of this forest, actually this might be the edge of the forest over here, is it? kind of looks like it ends 
somewhere around here. Maybe not, though. Hey, chicken. Chickens. Another chicken. Another bunch of chickens. Were they all there just a second ago? I only saw one. And then, all of a sudden, there were, like, five. That looks like something I would have made, but it's not. <laughs> Please be the monument. Please be the monument. Please be the monument. <laughs> I really hope it's the monument. I don't want to have to carry around a whole bunch more uh, pieces of wool, guys. I really don't. It doesn't look like it's the monument. That doesn't look like a monument. I don't think that looks like a monument. Oh, would you look at that? Oh, maybe this is the monument. Because it's got a nice little way to, uh... Oops. Just, just fix yourself. Or something. Oh, I suppose I probably could have done that, too. Whatever. That's... Problem solved. Um... But yeah, the reason I say it might be the monument is because... What's down here? Some iron. A bunch of dirt. Looks like it was just carved out of the ground. Um, I see this might be the monument because that was pretty... Oh, there was a way up. Okay. <laughs> um, that was pretty clear cut. Don't be another dungeon! No! Why is it another dungeon? Oh, no! <laughs> I didn't want another dungeon, guys. Well, we're level 71. <laughs> Hate my life. Wow, I didn't even see that. I need to be more thorough when I check the stupid chest. But okay, let's move all this stuff out of the way here. And... Throw down all that crap just so that we can pick stuff up when we're in here. Um, and let's go. I don't want a dungeon. Oh, God, no! What? Why? Oh, it's not blazes, it's just fire. Get out of here, man! <laughs> I don't like you. Okay, yep. Come get me. Nope, nope. That's blazes. Yep, there's the blaze. And out! Okay, well that's nice, but... Mm -hmm. Blazes, I don't like them. I don't like cave spiders either. Ow! Oh, I hate you! Get out of here! Okay, guys. That just looked like it would have been a silverfish block. No! Stop following me! This is ridiculous, man. Ridiculous. I don't know what to do with that. Okay, he can't get up there. Okay. So... Let's grab some stone. We're going to have to make a... Um... One of these things. And... Oh, there's water right out here. Fantastic. And just... Grab a bunch of those. Well, actually, I... Just drink one. Because we have one extra glass and... Well, I suppose I could make two of one kind of potion. Okay. Oh, my mouse doing that thing again. Maybe I need a new mouse. I don't know. It's kind of old, but it's also pretty expensive, so... Okay. So I can make 15 potions with this nether wart here. <laughs> um, which isn't a whole lot. Um, let's see, I'm going to make some regen potions and some... Well, right... I'll make some regen potions and some fire resist potions and shut up! Jeez. Um. Oh my god. This is gonna be really, really annoying. I can tell you that much. Maybe I can just run in, grab stuff, run out, 
we won't have a problem. Actually, you know what? Hold on. Is this... Yep, that's a hole straight down. And the blaze is going to come up. That isn't he. <laughs> I just... I mean, the blaze can probably still come up that, yeah, but... Um, okay. Let's just do this. <laughs> so he can't. Um, but, wow, that's a creepy noise. That's a really creepy noise. He needs to stop it. He just needs to stop it right now. Um, once we get the gut fire this potion, that's three minutes. That's pretty. That's a pretty decent length. Um, I would love to put some redstone in it, but I don't have any redstone. <laughs> so, yay! Yeah, hey. Should probably have kept some from before, but again, you know, my whole inventory was full. And there wasn't much I could do. But now that I've got some health, some fire resist potions, and some regen potions, and one of the reasons why I did put that lava there was so I could grab some, some water. Because that'll be pretty useful to have. If we're fighting blazes. Which, obviously, we are. That area didn't look lit up enough. Um, let's see, well, the bow is useless to us right now. <laughs> so let's just swap the... No. There we go. No. Yeah, there we go. That's that's fine. Okay. Drink this. All right. I want to take this. Now I'm just wasting precious time. Yep. Shoot your fireballs at me. There you go. <laughs> Sendermen in water over here. I don't know what's going on with this. I'll seal that off for now come back later, and then I'll come in here and kill all these guys. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Okie dokie. Yeah, they're all fighting each other now, so... Oh god, just die, guys. That creeper seems trapped. What is going on here? Oh god! Oh, okay, it's just a normal spider. We're good. I thought he was a, uh... Poison spider for a second. So I freaked out a little bit. But it's all good. Where? Oh god, guys, this dungeon is so weird. Okay, take that, and... I want this, actually. Put that back, put that back, put that back. I don't need any of that. This will be useful, I guess. Um, poison spiders down there. Some gold. Yeah, yeah, I hear ya. Whoa! Bad time for frame rate lag. I mean, come on. Okay, yeah, I have no idea where those poisonous spiders... Okay, well, apparently they came from up. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure one just fell to its death. So, oh, get back. Okay, let's try coming through here. Oh god, what is that? I don't know what it is. Brick? The heck? Ow! Oh, god! Okay, I'm drinking a regen potion. And just hop in here. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, you just get... Ah, oh, stop it! Okay, these guys should be dying faster, but for some reason I can only hit them, like, once every couple seconds. Ow, where? Where are you coming from? Alright. Where? Stop it! Oh. Is that where they're spawning from? Up there? 
Why can't I jump? Oh, God. Yeah, that might be it. Well, it's a spawner. I have no idea what kind. Is still regenerating health? Nope. I'm not resistant to fire, either. Oh, well, that's a bad time for the blaze spawner. Also a really bad time. Where is it? Oh, no, guys. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God, guys. That was terrifying. Were any of you as scared as I was right there? Oh, boy. This game does not good things to you. Okay, let's go back this way. No. No. Quit it. Where are you coming from? You little buggers. Sorry, I'm so quiet, guys. What? I, I didn't drink the fires this one? Alright, well, now I did. Is this where the blaze spawner was? Yeah, I think it was. Oh my god! Die! Die a million times over! Okay, you just pop up here real quick. Yeah, there you go. I'll hop down. Where are they coming from? I just grabbed a bunch of fences that I didn't want. Mm. Oh my god! <sighs> These poison spiders, man. I don't know what to do. I don't know why I did that. Oops, I didn't look at you, buddy. Okay, just doing that so I can make some torches. Without dying. And all of the good stuff that being murdered involves. <sighs> this dungeon is not nice, guys. Even with my diamond armor, this is still rough. Oh god, so many spawners. Oh, I don't even know what to say, guys. Oh man. Aside from too many spawners. Oh no. Oh man. Don't do that to me. Too many cave spider spawners. Jeez. 
That's one of the problems here. Like, it would be one thing if these spawners were anything but cave spiders. I don't know what to make of those little side tunnels. Okay, let's make our way down here. Okay, I think the only threat to... Okay, well, now that guy over there is a threat. Ugh. I can't reach him. And there's nothing underneath me. Fantastic! Let's just do that real quick. Okay. Hey, there's a skeleton. Mmm. Okie dokie. Man, that's a lot of stuff down there. Makes me wish I had that lava. But I do have TNT. Um, there it is. And go! Dang it! Forgot they changed that. Okay, that should have taken care of most of them. And everything in that chest, as well. <laughs> Unintended, but not totally unwanted side effect. Man, I'm good. Oh, down the hole, zombie. Here you go. Fight it out. Just don't mind me while I uh, walk through the middle of you. Okay, down there looks dangerous. Um, down there definitely looks dangerous. I like TNT, guys. Also, that redstone looks like a trap. <laughs> Not to be Admiral Akbar, but just saying. Okay. Not quite there yet. Oh, hey, look at that. Okay, well, there's obviously spawners around somewhere, because I just saw a cave... Sp oh, well, maybe the cave spider fell. Okay, I suppose that makes sense. <laughs> look how many bottles of enchanting we have, guys. Less crap on the floor. Okay, got the pink wool. Got all this cobblestone on the floor that I'm just not picking up. Here we go. Go down and grab this, just because I'm running out of um bricks. And ooh, redstone. That's actually really good. See, now I'm wondering if there's more wool in here. I mean, I feel like if there was, it would have to be in a pretty obvious place, like, in a different tunnel system. You know what I mean? Not all in here with all of the other crap. Okay, well, that's that works, too. Yeah, I know, I'm gonna probably get... Okay, or he's just gonna miss. Where are these guys coming from? Man, there's so many chests here. Oh, boy. Isn't that teamwork? Um, that's funny. I think I actually remember seeing something like that. Uh, there's a mod called Dwarves vs. Zombies. Okay, well, apparently they're spawning right... Okay, well, they're fighting, so... That's not a complaint. Um, but, uh, yeah, there's this 
mod called Dwarves vs. Zombies, where it's basically um, a bunch of people play, start out, as, everybody starts out, starts out as dwarves, and um, it's a server mod. Um, it's, 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 it's a game. That, I don't know why I started so much when I said that. It's, it's like a game, um, like, if you had a capture the flag in, in Minecraft or something like that, you know, um, where you get a bunch of people together and play it. And it is, um, it's a team thing. You have one team is the dwarves and one team is the zombies. I mean, well, technically, yes. Um, and the, everybody starts out as a dwarf and you, you all get different classes. Uh, some of you are builders, some of you are uh, alchemists, there's tailors and bakers. I think that's it. Um, the alchemists make potions for people, and they work a little bit differently than they do in the actual game. Um, the potions, you can use them based on how much experience you have. Uh, I'll, I'll get into that later. Um, the uh, bakers make food like cake and cookies. Actually, that's, well, that's the only things that they can make is cake and cookies. Um, but, uh, I wonder if he just, like, hit this on accident and decided to put spawners in here for fun. Well, that explains where all the endermen were coming from. Oh, darn. He blew up. Okay, let's see what's in here. More bottles of enchanting. More bottles of enchanting. Okay, guys. I think we're going to be, like, level 100 by the end of this uh, playthrough. Oh, hi there. Okay. And it looks like this is about the end of this dungeon. So, um, I'm going to keep that water with me, actually, because it's it's probably going to be pretty useful. Well, see, lava's really useful for killing stuff, but um, water's really useful for not dying. Because, um, dang it! Get. Just get, okay? There you go. Okay. Well, we've got another wool now. Uh, let's... Before we end the episode, let's run through all of these bottles of enchanting real quick. Real quick and noisy. Um... <clears throat> uh, I'll finish talking about, uh... Dwarves and Zombies before I go, though. Um... So, like I said, you start out as dwarves, and then you the builders build a, a, a fort, basically, like some kind of castle or whatever to protect yourselves from the zombies. And um, the, the bakers make food, the tailors make armor, uh, diamond armor, which doesn't really make a whole lot of sense, but, you know, who cares. And the... Um, gonna make those long... Oh, darn. <laughs> that sucks. Um, there we go. Uh, they make... Tailors make diamond armor. I don't really know how that makes sense, but... You know. Anyway. The blacksmiths make... Wait. Yeah, the, yeah, that's right. Uh, the blacksmiths make... Tools, I think? Like, weapons and stuff? Um, so... I don't really know why... <laughs> I, I think it's just so that you can get armor and weapons from different people that they split it up. Um, but, you know. And the... Let's see, what over the alchemist, tailor, builder, and baker. And and blacksmith. Yeah, I forgot, I forgot blacksmith earlier. But alchemist makes motions, and... Yeah, okay. Anyway. And each class makes different things, obviously. So, um, everybody needs something from each of the people when it comes time to fight. Um, you have two knights, or on the second night, um, the, the dragon comes. Uh, well, it depends. Like, there, there is a server up and running with the thing playing on it, but um, it's the, the person who made it server, so you can only get in, you know, if you go onto the Twitch thing and, um, and ask to be part of it, and then they may or may not let you in if they have enough space. Um, and redstone. <clears throat> so hopefully that'll increase that to, like, a minute and a half or something. 
And then we'll make some really long uh, fire resist potions, too. And that'll be really awesome. So, when you each person has a book, and they use that book to get the materials that they need to do stuff, um, <clears throat> and sometimes some other stuff, like, I think tailors get gold out... Oh, two minutes, actually. That's really awesome. I think tailors get gold that they give to um, blacksmiths, I believe, who make watches, and then turn those watches, which I actually have two of right now, and then those watches they make into weapons and stuff. And I think the blacksmiths get brick that the the bakers use, and then the bakers get bones. No missing one. Bakers would get... Oh, I don't know. But they all get something that they need to give to somebody else in order for them to make their stuff. So it requires teamwork and everything. And then, on the second night, the dragon comes and kills a bunch of people before it, before it gets killed, usually. Um, and then, when people die, they become zombies. But not necessarily zombies, it's just the name of the team. They become one of the mobs in the game, and they all have special abilities and everything, and it's all cool and stuff. Um, right, I forgot I was supposed to be doing this this whole time. Uh, but yeah, so it's pretty cool. Um, I've, I've never played it, because like I said, they've got, um, oh good, I picked up more Nether War too. They've got one server going, and it's, it's kind of like, I, I don't want to say, like, restricted access, but, you know, you know what I mean. Um, so, yeah, but it's a cool mod, and I forget what I was talking about it. Which is kind of unfortunate, but oh well. Um, let's see. I need to make space in my inventory now because I obviously can't carry all of these. I need one, two, three, four, five, six spaces. Oh boy. Get rid of that. Get rid of that because at least I can do something with the cobblestone. Um, let's see. I can get rid of. The bow is just so useful. I don't want to get rid of that. Oh, this should be done by now. Okay, do that. Um. Oh, there's nothing to, that I can get rid of here. Like, I could leave all the stuff here, but would I be able to find it again? I mean, oh. I think I might be able to find it. Oh, sorry, that's, that's Skype. Um, that's probably Jimmy. Jimmy, if you're watching this, you're interrupting. I mean, I'm actually, like, ten minutes over. And I've just been talking for the last ten minutes, but... Um, oops, right, I wanted to put the... That in there. And I don't know what I'll do with this. I guess I'll just drink this one. And then throw it. And hey, that clears up a space, doesn't it? Or something? No, it doesn't, because I still have three of <laughs> those things. Dang it! Um, I don't know, guys. I'll sort this out, and then I'll see you next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye.